the world's in lockdown. Where am I supposed to find a terrorist? Here, yeah, terrorist! Hi everybody and welcome. Today we'll be going over the SOG Tomahawk. I bought this on Taobao, which is like the Amazon for China. It comes directly from the factories, therefore the prices are very cheap. This Tomahawk cost me 39 renminbi, which is $5. Uh, it weighs about 600 grams. The total length of it from this end to there is about 40 centimeters. The head on it is 17 centimeters. They say it's made from 420 steel. They don't specify what steel it is. Comes in this little sheath that slips onto it. Then if we look at the head, you'll see that there's a marking there. It says shooty or something. Same on the other side. Nice long beard coming down, very sharp at the end. If you look at it, it's quite thick. I would like to have the profile a little bit thinner to make it more slicey. It does chop. It's got the hammer end on the back instead of the spike this is to chop in 10 steaks or, or sorry hit in 10 steaks and chop nuts and stuff that's why I got it it's more for outdoor use than fighting applications the hand is reinforced nylon or plastic it's got a shaft that runs down three quarters of the way and then bolted on by these hex bits I just put it on the table next to the the Delica or the Endura 4 and the Dragonfly just to give you a little bit of scale to this. I tried it out, it chops pretty well. There's only two downsides to this. As I said before, the edge profile. Once I get to a grinder, I can do the edge profile a little bit thinner. It does seem to hold up, the edge retention is fine. I've chopped a few logs and stuff holds up fine another problem I have is the sheath itself it does have a belt loop and it's got these robots the problem is once the tomahawk in the sheath let me show you what I'm talking about I put the tomahawk in the sheath what happens? The beard pokes out at the bottom. This is quite dangerous as it's very sharp. Solution is to have another rubber there, you know, or put in a seam of some sort, a plastic cover maybe, who knows. But I'll later on I'll make a little Kydex sheath for this so I can put it onto a backpack with Molly. For the price, very good investment I think. It will come in handy. Once we start camping, you'll probably see it in a couple of videos coming up as soon as start, things start opening up again after this lockdown period and summer comes. We'll be going out and doing some overnighters and that. So please come back for those videos. Remember to like, subscribe and then come back in future for more videos. Thank you and goodbye. <laughs>